I'm Holly Silva and I've been a crafts expert for 15 years and today I'm going to show you a free acorn craft for kids. So here I have some sales papers. You got these things all over the place, can't stand them, don't know what to do with them, but throw them away. But here we're going to use them in a way. So what we're going to do is take like a really colorful piece. Let's choose this one. And we're going to draw out the shape of an acorn. All right, so now that we have it drawn out, we're going to cut that out. I'm going to go in with our scissors there and cut around. Sometimes it's easier just to cut out the basic shape. That way you don't have to mess with all this extra paper there. And then go around so you have better access to it. So you can see what we're doing here. A nice little shape here. There you go. All right. Now that we've got that, we've got one acorn. But let's change it up, okay? We're going to do a double-sided acorn. So now that we have that cut out, we're going to take this piece and we're going to trace it again. Now you can do this one of two ways. You can do what I'm doing, cut one piece out, trace another piece on another piece of paper, or you can layer the pieces of paper together and cut them out at the same time. I prefer this because you can see what you're doing a little bit better. And if you decide to change up the shape at some point, it's easier to do that if you, have, if you do it separately than if you do it together. Your line here. Wonderful. There we go. Okay, set these aside so we can see what we're doing. Now check that out. Okay. So now we have a popsicle stick, which we're going to apply glue to at the top on both sides like so and we're going to stick it here in the center and we're going to place our acorn both sides of the acorn over the top so now that you have your two pieces of acorn stuck to the stuck to your popsicle stick you're going to take a brown marker and you're going to color it in. Now with waxy papers, you may want to use like a magic marker or something like that so that the marker stays. Because if you use a water soluble marker, it may come off on your hands or clothes. So you want to be careful with the things that you're working with. Remember, when you're doing free projects, meaning you're not spending much money on it and you know you're using whatever you've got around the house it's most important to be able to improvise as with any crafts actually you want to improvise right so just color that in you can even paint it if you have some brown paint that would be nice too flip it over do the other side of course while you're doing this craft or while you're working on this project. It would also be pretty cool as an adult while the kid is doing this craft to maybe read to them where acorns come from, the history of it, or you know, some educational things. Kids are always wanting to learn. And it's much easier to get them to learn while they're doing something fun like this. So there you have your free acorn craft. See you next time.